Jeffrey Gartenstein with Quirky Gourmet. Today I'm going to show you how to make a cold bean dip. Now when you're making a cold bean dip, you want to use a little more liquid to make it creamy than you would if you were making a warm bean dip. Because you know, warm beans, you know, there's steam coming off them, there's more moisture just in general. And with the cold ones, you know, just maybe a little extra oil, extra yogurt, extra sour cream, whatever it is that you're mixing it with. So I'm going to some beans in the food processor. I'm going to use a mix of beans. There's some garbanzo beans. Here's some pinto beans. And here's some white cannellini beans. I'm going to put some roasted onions in there with them. I just chopped up the onions, rubbed them with olive oil, put them in the oven for about 20 or 30 minutes. I'm going to add some olive oil. I'm going to be pretty generous with the olive oil. I'm just mixing it up until it's reasonably smooth. I'm going to transfer it to a bowl. And I'm going to add some yogurt. And some salt. And then also some seasoning salt. This is a blend that has some rosemary, it has some uh, lemon peel, it has some tomato flakes. You can really use any kind of seasoning salt you want. They're mostly, you know, just nice mixes of tasty herbs and spices. And there you have a cold bean dip.